boom, our house is now complete. Oh, Sabawa, what is that? What the heck? It looks like a rainbow castle. Whoa. And wait, there's a sign that says Red's Lab? Who's Red? I have no idea, but I love Red. Let's go inside. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, Roxy, I think we should be a little bit careful. And whoa, there's a giant sign that says R-E-D. What does that spell? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared! Holmes, we should not be in here. What? Why not? Have you not heard of Scientist Red? Scientist Red? No, I haven't heard of him. And wait a minute, there's a sign over here. It says, Experiment Rainbow Friends. What? What's Experiment Rainbow Friends? Oh no, they're upstairs. Wait, what? They're upstairs? Um, Roxy, what's upstairs? <laughs> Wait, why, why are you screaming? Oh my gosh, what? Guys, it's the Rainbow Friends. It's yellow, orange, cyan, green, and blue. Good thing they're locked up in a cage. Ah, uh, Luke, there's a sign here that says releasing in 10 minutes to attack. Oh, they're gonna attack us. Oh, uh, run to the house. Go, 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 go. Rainbow Friends are the most powerful bombs. I know. What do we do to defend our house? We need a tier tier around our Base. That is a great idea. We can make the whole front row of our base have TNT droppers to make it right on the rainbow, friends. So everyone grab a bunch of droppers. All right, what's next? Next, we need to grab some redstone, some redstone repeaters, and some redstone torches. Now, everyone, follow my lead. We're going to make it start from down over here at the house, and we got to build all the way up over here. And this should be a good height right about here. Now, we have to place a bunch of droppers facing down. And while I do this, you guys fill them all up with some TNT. All right, on it. Thank you, and boom, this should be a good line of droppers. Now, on top of all the droppers, we have to add a bunch of redstone dust to activate them all. And we need to make the access point all the way down back at the house over here. So let's break inside and set the redstone down just like that. Now we need to add a lever over here, and we want to be able to see our TNT destruction. So let's make some remodeling to the house by breaking it and grabbing some glass blocks. And let's set it on the front over here and whoa perfect i have perfect view of the droppers so let's test it out and wait well wow, only three pieces of tnt spawned in what the heck it's supposed to be like 10 it's because the redstone doesn't reach oh yeah you're right the redstone stops up over here so we have to grab our redstone repeater and then add it right over here to extend the current now let's see if it works so let's go back into the house and test number two starting you guys ready yep ready Let's do it! And oh my gosh, it all works! So much TNT! Destroy everything! Let's go! Oh, a giant explosion! I know, right? It wrecked the entire floor! They're gonna stand no chance against this! But there's a lot of rainbow friends! What if some escape? Oh gosh, you're totally right! There's too many for one TNT blast to take out! We need a second layer of defense! We can make a lava pit trap! That I know, right? We can make it so the entire floor over here disappears and they fall into lava. So let's grab some sticky pistons. And first, we need to clear out the way where the trap is going to be. So it's going to be right over here. All righty. It's now all complete. Now we have to go a little bit deep in because we don't want the lava to be on the surface. We want it to be underground because it's a hidden trap. Oh, really smart, Mike. And boom, the entire trap is mined out. Now we're gonna need to grab some deadly dangerous lava and put it all on the bottom. And this is surely gonna get a bunch of them out. So let's place all the lava down over here like this. Perfect. So now we need a way to close out the top because the rainbow friends are gonna be way too smart. They're gonna know there's a trap here. So let's use our sticky pistons and let's fill up the top layer all with sticky pistons facing inside just like that. All right, on it. And boom, this side is all complete. Now let's do the other side over here and fill it up all with some sticky pistons. I'm gonna do this side. Thank you, Luke. And boom, now all the sticky pistons are set. So once they're activated, check that out. They're gonna close it up. And we have to make it activate the entire side over here. So let's mine it down like that. So let's put redstone torches all underneath all of the pistons like that. So now they're all activated. And 
and boom, this side is completely active, so it covers up the lava. Now we just need to make it so these redstone torches can turn off. So let's set a layer of blocks all behind them just like this, and then put some redstone repeaters facing each and every one of them like that. Perfect. Then behind all the redstone repeaters, we're gonna need to add a bunch of redstone dust. And boom, we're done. Now we just need to connect it to the surface. So let's test it out. If I have a lever over here, we flick it. It should, yes, pull back all of the blocks. Awesome. Now we just need to hook up the other side. And boom, now all the redstone is hooked up. So we just need to connect it to the lever up over here. So let's make the redstone go all the way around. And wait, what? Only some of them activated. Add a repeater to make the signal reach. Oh yeah, you're right now. It should work. So let's test it all at once. And whoa, the lava pit works. This is awesome. So once they're standing here, we can flick the lever and boom, they're gonna fall in. But, um, there's like 10 of them. Yeah, so what? There's 10 rainbow friends. They can all like scooch each other inside and fit in here. What? No way. Oh gosh, you're right. They're not gonna all fit in here. Oh no, oh no, oh no. We need something to get rid of the really strong ones. Did you see the new ones, Cyan and Yellow? Yes, yeah, Cyan is like the strongest one ever. What do we do to get them? Any ideas? What if we make fireball candy? That is a genius idea. Yes, we can make a layer of fireball cannons over here. So let's put a layer of dispensers all over here next to our house like that. Then on this side, we're going to have to hook them all up to some redstone. So let's break the back side and connect some wooden planks over here with repeaters going into them and some redstone dust. And now I think this should work. Is it really that easy? Let me test it out. And wait, yeah, it does work. All we have to do is add the fireballs. Everyone put some fireballs in. On it. This is going to be the most deadly dangerous trap ever. And boom, they're all filled up. Now let's test it with the balls inside. Hey, ya go. And oh, whoa, it actually works. Chill, you're gonna get them upset too early. Wait, you're right. I don't want them to get mad too soon. Now everyone, we need to grab some cobblestone walls and we need to make a perimeter of security. So everyone set walls down. Roxy, you go that way and I'll go this way, okay? All right, race you to the back. Oh, what? Race me. You're never gonna beat me, Roxy. I am the fastest wall placer in the world. I'm gonna beat you. What? No way. And I'm already at the back. Ah, Roxy. Wait a minute. So are you. Meet you to the middle. I'm about to be there right now. No, 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 no. Slow down. Slow down. Oh, my gosh. Whoa. You beat me by so much. Oh, my gosh. Oh, good job, Roxy. I am the wall placer. <laughs> Great job, buddy. But we also need some security around the fences. So everyone grab some sand and some cactuses. And on the outside, place a bunch of sand down first, okay? Huh? Why? You'll see in a second. Just place a bunch of sand. Trust me on this, okay? Okay. I hope this is good. No, no. Roxy, it's going to be good. I promise. And boom. All the sand is set. Now grab some cactuses and we can make some cactus traps by placing it on the sand. Because the only blocks we can place cactuses on is sand. Oh, yeah. I get it now. And whoa, so much green. I love green. Of course you do, Luke. It's your favorite color. And boom, all the cactuses are set. No way the rainbow friends are getting past this. Well, Oops, how are we gonna get through the fences? Oh, wait, I did not think about that. We don't even have a way to get inside. We need a way to open up the fences automatically. And I know exactly how. So let's break some blocks underneath the gate over here like that and add some sticky pistons. Now, all we have to do is hook up some redstone. Now, if we hook up a lever, boom, we can automatically open and close the gates. Isn't this awesome? Yeah, only we can do it since they don't know how to use their hands. Yeah, they're like noobs at the game. And boom, I can close it. Let's go. But guys, I know what we really need. Come over here. We need a bunch of security guards. So let's make a fenced off area over here. And this is going to be the guards quarters. Oh my gosh, I already know where we're going to do. What? You have no idea what we're going to do. We're going to do iron golems. Wait, what? How did you know? Oh my gosh, Rox, you're getting so good. But yeah, you're right. We're going to do some iron golems. So let's grab some blocks of iron. And we need to make four security guards since there's four of us. So let's make a T shape. And then on top of the T, put a carved pumpkin head. And boom, we just made life. We have an iron golem. Now let's do the same for each of us. This one's mine. His name is John. John? Are you serious? Is that actually his name? Yeah, he's the best fighter 
ever. Oh my gosh. And this one is mine. His name is Omzi. What? Omzi Poo? No, it's just Omzi. This one's mine. What? Princess L? Does she take a lot of L's? No, it stands for a lily. Oh, I get it. But now we need to make a way for them to get out of here. And since we already made the gate system over there, it's super duper easy. I know exactly what we have to do. We just place three sticky pistons facing up, throw some redstone next to them all like that, and then boom, the system is complete. Now we can easily open and close the gate so they can come whenever we need their help. <laughs> I know, right? It's awesome. But, um, guys, what if the guards aren't enough? And what if the rainbow friends make it through? We need a self-destruct button. Oh, yeah. That is so smart. Everyone, follow me. We're going to make the self-destruct button all the way on the inside. So let's grab the button. And no one ever hit this button unless we want to destroy everything. Now let's go to the back and set our redstone torch elevator a billion bajillion blocks in the air. Wait, it's an elevator. What? No, Roxy, you always ask this. No, you can't ride it. It's for redstone currents to go all the way to the top easily. Um, that sounds hard to do. What? It's not hard. We just did it. And boom, this should be high enough. Oh, this just looks so complicated. Well, it's literally just a line of blocks. What are you talking about? And now up over here, we have to set up all the deadly dangerous TNT. I love this part. Everyone, spam TNT all above the base. We have to make a ginormous layer. Okay. And boom, all the TNT is set. Let's go. Now we have to make a layer of normal blocks above it. Race it to it. Wow, you're never going to beat me. I'm the fastest clicker in the world. Check me out. No, I'm already butterfly clicking. What? Butterfly clicking? Oh my gosh, you're going so quick. And boom, I'm done over here. Let's go. And you guys know the next step, right? Is it what? What? No, it's redstone. Water is literally the opposite of what it is. We have to fill up the top layer with redstone. I love redstone, so I'm the fastest placer ever. What, Roxy, you are not the fastest placer. I am the fastest placer. I'm really good at using redstone, even though I don't really like it. I'm bad at using redstone, even though I like it. What? Oh, my gosh, we're such opposites. And boom, all the redstone is set. Now, the final step is to use redstone repeaters and place them randomly. Oh, this is the funnest part. I know, right? I love placing it randomly, and I am the fastest placer in all of the universe. Oh, just how many I already placed? Like one? No, like 20. But there's not even 20 down, Lily. You're capping hard, but boom, all the repeaters are set. Now, all we have to do is hook up this redstone torch all the way up and around to here, just like this. And oh gosh, no one touch the button down there until we're ready. Are you sure? Hey, no, Roxy, seriously, stop. Don't do it. But let's go down. Let's go back into the house. And uh, guys, how are we going to hit this button and like just stand here? Won't we get blown up? Yeah, we need a way to escape. Exactly. And I know just how. We're going to make a roller coaster out of here, baby. So let's break these blocks. And I'm going to make a path. And Roxy, you play some rails behind me, all right? All right. And I'm going to make this go all the way around over here and a little bit more down, actually. And this should be the perfect spot to stop the minecart. So from here, we can have a great view of all the action. So let's set it all down with some blocks over here because we're going to make a little room to watch. And let's build walls around just like that. Then on this side, let's build some walls like this. And then in the front, we're going to need to grab some protective glass because we do not want all the TNT to hit us. Yeah, that would be terrible. <laughs> I know, right? But boom, we now have the glass wall. But the problem is once we hit the button, it's going to activate the TNT right away. We have to make the TNT button hit delayed by a couple of seconds and I know just how. What's the Activation hits up here. We're going to make a super duper ooper schmooper log delay. So let's grab our redstone repeater and then make it super duper ooper schmooper slow. So this should take about five seconds to activate. And five seconds is all we're going to need to get to the other side, baby. So let's place it all down. Test out how long it takes. All right, we could do a test. So I'm going to make all the repeaters reach over here like this. Now, Roxy, activate the button right now. All right. And you hit it, and oh my gosh, yes, it takes so much time. Awesome. Um, is it done yet? No, 
it's still going on. Let's go. This is so much delay. We'll be able to escape super easily. Now, all we have to do is just put a repeater over here. Then put a piece of redstone dust up here. And now it's all set. Make sure to not hit that button now, okay? And now all we have to do is add some minecarts. So let's grab a chest. Put it right over here and grab all the minecarts we need, baby. So let's store them all in. So let's add one for me, one for Luke, one for Lily, and one for Roxy. And boom, the minecarts are set. But, um, how are we gonna fight them? Oh, wait. I did not think about that. We're naked right now. We need armories. Come on, guys. Everyone pick a corner. I choose this one. Why that was gonna be mine? Oh, my gosh. Well, I'll choose this one. I want this one. And I'm gonna get this corner. All right, everyone, make your automatic armories. So we're gonna need to grab some dispensers. So let's make the armory by putting some dispensers like that and down over here. Now we're gonna need to grab a fence with a pressure plate on top. Now all we have to do is set it down and boom, it works. Pick out your armor, guys. I choose that. What? Netherite, that's the most powerful one. I'm gonna choose diamond armor because it's light blue, my favorite. I'm gonna get gold. I'm gonna get iron. Nice. All right, everyone, now store it into every single dispenser just like this. And boom, perfect. It's all filled. So now when we walk into it, we automatically get loaded up. Wait, how? Oh, gosh, yeah, it has been. And that means we're about to escape. Oh, gosh, everyone, 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 put your armor on. Go, go, go. And boom, I'm fully loaded up. Everyone, follow me. Let's see if they're actually coming. Go, 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 go. Let's open the gates. And hello, any rainbow friends over here? Wait, I think I hear orange. Oh, my gosh, I think I see orange. Oh, gosh, everyone, beat him up. Get him. Hey, yo, I'm attacking. Go for it, guys. Go for it. Oh, my gosh. She is mega strong. Ow. Stop hitting. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Oh, my gosh. She makes such scary noises. Go, 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 go. He must be almost dead. He has to be low. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Wait, I got him. What? Really? Let's go. Nice job, Roxy. But wait, I think I hear more. Oh, gosh. Let's see. Oh, my gosh. It's you. Get him, get him, get him. He's super powerful. Oh, gosh, I don't want to be taken by his helicopter wings. Everyone, attack. Ah! Mom, he got you. What? Are you serious? Mom, we got him. No way, really? Yeah, he's gone. Let's go. Nice job. But who's next? It sounds like blue. Wait, blue. Oh, my gosh, guys. Lead him down. Let him take some damage from our cactuses. And oh, my gosh. He is ginormous. Come over here, Mr. Blue. Feel the wrath of my cactuses. Blue, go. Yeah. And, wait, what? why is he not touching any of the cactuses? He literally breaks them when he gets near the Broxy. Are you serious? Whoa, he's crazy. What the heck? Oh, gosh, guys. I'm going back. I'm going back. I'm going to activate the fireballs. Keep him there. Hey, ah! Is it attacking him? Yeah, you hit him. Let's go! He's on fire! What are you gonna do about it, Blue? Yeah! You die! Oh my gosh, he's super strong, guys. We're gonna have to lower him into the TNT rainfall. Open the gates! All right, I'm opening it. Come over here, Mister Blue, and feel the wrath of the TNT. The button should be right over here. Ready, guys? Do it! I'm doing it! Attack! Come on, come on, come on! And, oh my gosh! Wait, um, guys, I think the TNT missed. I'm putting in more. And oh gosh, he's coming to the door! Oh, Oh, Roxy, he's inside the house! Ah! Oh my gosh, we literally destroyed everything. Even the piston trap we made with lava. What's that silver skull? Oh my gosh, but he broke the lever. Okay, okay, guys, I'm gonna lure him in. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Uh, guys, I think we just activated the oh, final TNT. He's still alive. But he's trapped in the lava. Oh god, did it not go to plan at all? Get him, get him, get him. I'm pushing him into the lava. Me too, yeah. Go, 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 go. Oh, they got him! Oh, I'm so low, guys! And wait, what? You guys did get him! Let's go! But, um, what are we gonna do with the rest of the rainbow friends? Oh, gosh, there's still a bunch more, and, um... Our final explosion happened too early. What do we do, Roxy? Let's just beat up the last one. Oh, yeah, let's go. And the last one is Cyan. He's like a dinosaur. Everyone attack. Let's just beat up the last one. Oh, yeah, let's go. And the last one is Cyan. He's like a dinosaur. Everyone attack Cyan. You're going down it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, um, Roxy, are you okay? He just one-shotted me. What do you mean he just one-shotted you? Oh, my gosh. Uh, Lily, do we really want to fight this guy? I got um, Lily, are you sure you want to... Oh, gosh. He got me 
too. I got this. Oh, uh, Luke, are you sure you wanted to do that? Oh my gosh. Well, I'll get him. I'll save my friends. All right, we all died. And that was an awesome adventure. And if you want to join us on the next, click right here. Bye. Bye.